tell me, brother? How's life been? Good, lovely. Hey, boys, we back on the road, man. Gonna go out here and hopefully we get some fish, man. We just restringed up the poles. Y'all see it? Just put the new 65 pound braid on this $250 reel. So hopefully we can catch something. We're just gonna put it to use. Got the other pole in the back. I know hopefully we are gonna catch something. Oh, my bad, brother. We we catch some? We I bet. He said we're gonna catch something. Yeah, we're going to get us. some crap at this time. And man, we're gonna turn it up. So you know what's going on, fellas. Back at y'all with another video. We're raising canes right now, getting us some large coffee. Some large coffee. Large coffee. You know, we got a long drive. Wrong grind. No okay. matter what, we're gonna bring some fish on. Something back. So we need to check to see if that uh the water we going to, since we going we going to well, we going to we going to Anawake fish or we going to Port Arthur? Where we going? We, you said we want to catch some crappies. All right, baby. I don't, don't think no crappies over there. Oh, thank you. Well, we're going to Anawak, y'all. We're going to slide to Anawak. And we're going to uh, catch some crappie out there, man, under the bridge. That's how it is. So hopefully, uh, and hopefully, I say hopefully, we are going to do a catch and cook today, man. Got bro with me. He got some free time. I got some free time. Whenever we catch, as long as we catch above six, which I'm guaranteed we're going to catch a bunch of them. It's a beautiful day. We're gonna catch, we're gonna cook them at the house, man. And we're gonna, you know, enjoy and see how they taste, man. We're gonna let him season them up this time to see how he seasoned his fish. And uh, we're gonna go for another, boys. So, we're gonna see how it is. Yeah, we got the Raisin Cane, man. This is the box combo right here. We got the fries, we got the chicken strips, and we got the famous cane sauce and the good toast right here, man. We get extra toast, no coleslaw. I ain't a coleslaw guy. Extra toast, no cold sauce, so we finna eat this up, man, before we get out here on this fish creek so we can fish an unlimited time, man. And, uh, yeah, man, we're just gonna do it like that. Mayo. So this is what we're gonna use right here. This is by Whack Attack Lewis. This is the hot tamale right here. Y'all can see that, it's the hot tamale. That's the color we're gonna use, we're gonna jig, and then we're gonna set up a uh, minnow on the next pole. We got an eight ounce uh, jig head that we're gonna be using, and we're gonna set up the, the cart at about six feet. So I'll probably do it the length of my body. I'm 5'11", so we'll just go off of that and we'll jig that deep and whatnot, so. So, we got about 65 pound braid on this one. Just uh, reel this one up, that just came from Amazon. I forgot the brand of the braid, but I just like the color, that's the reason why I got it, so. <laughs> just for I just the color, like, right? Yeah, just for the color. No purpose, y'all, just the color. So we're gonna set this up like this. These right here are little uh, stoppers for the cart. Slip knots, what you call them. Take one of these out. I gave you 500 likes. Appreciate you for the 500 likes, man. Make sure y'all go follow and subscribe him on uh, YouTube. LFG Fishing on YouTube, man. Link will be in the bio after this. Going on y'all, fishing about six foot deep man. Hopefully we can get one. Just gonna fish by these pillars. And uh, just let, really just a waiting game right now man. So, let's go see if we can get something to bite. If we get one to bite, then we know it's a bunch of them down though. So, we'll see how that go. Water cold right now, so we're not expecting one to be active as quick. But, really just a waiting game right now. Hey man, we almost lost the pole messing around with this fish man. Y'all see it? So good. Yeah. Little baby. Anything is better than nothing, though, man. Anything is better than nothing. I think this fight right here was probably the best investment I've had all year. One of uh, This shit coming handy for real, for real. What we got right here? Right here is a... Uh, bait bucket, man. Got two poles out, one with the minnow on it. 
This one right here, we're just gonna jig up and down these uh, little pillars right here. See if we can get something to take it. Yeah, I know him, bro. No, I do. <laughs> oh, that nigga hacksaw, see? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know you knew what 808 even turned on. <laughs> Say it again. Yeah, I'm gonna show you. The... All right, bet. Let me see. He did the bad right here. Let's get on your own. Making my own too sometimes. But uh that bitch right there bad and that right there bad. Clear water, them two key. I like them right there. Whole I made that right there. That's when nice. the sun's shining and I yeah. got a certain kind of skirt shit that I put on them, mm -hmm. I be nailing them. So you be you just making for yourself or you you celebrating? Oh. oh Oh, you good? I'm good. Oh. You good? I where I was at. Oh I'm good, man. Yeah. Hey, that gonna mess up a fishing day right there. Huh? I said that mess up a fishing day right there. I can't fish with no wet feet while it's cold. Fit the whole, look at that, he still got the men on his mouth. Showing good. He still got the men on his mouth, man. Give my bait back, man. We gotta catch another one. We don't need you. Look at that, he's trying to put the whole thing in his mouth. A little striping, man. These right here, man, pull your damn uh pull your pole in the water. You get the big ones like this, they'll just snatch the whole pole in there. We almost had that happen to us earlier, but. We managed to come out of it, man. Just a little baby boy, man. But once again, as long as we out here catching, that's all we really matter about, man. We out here just having a good time. A little small fish. Y'all can see it. What the fuck? God damn! <laughs> that was so much slow. They wait all the shit. God damn. We get that one, man. We can get back in the water, y'all. Jump show. Get back in the water, baby. They start to turn up. Yeah, we got some over here uh, messing with the cart again. Like I said, they come around, and they nibble on it. It was like this the other day, man. We had some, uh, we had some, some of the same size crappies by like this right here, man. Perfect size. They come in, they nibble just like this. They'll move the cart just like that. You'll think it's just a small one playing with it. And the whole time it's a big slab on them. So man, you really can't judge on how the cart moving. Because they, they ain't been really active. I guess it's been too cold. But they've been just messing with the bobble. They'll move it a little bit. And when you pull up, man, you got something like that on there. So we're just going to really chill. And hopefully pull one of them good ones up, man. That we can we get a few of them. Like I said, they come on. They come off. The timing, man, got to be right. Y'all new to the video, man, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, gladly appreciate it, man. We're on the road to 1,000, then the next road gonna be 2,000, man. Y'all help us get to 1,000, man. We're gonna do a giveaway at 1,000. Might do a poll and some lures or something, but we're gonna definitely do a, a giveaway at 1,000. 
and then the next row to be 2000 and then so on and so forth so make sure y'all comment under this video so you can enter into the giveaway and uh we're gonna go for now man i'm gonna try to make this run this up for sure for sure he took it under yeah. There you go. There we go. There we go. He got it. He got it. He got it. He got it. Oh no! That was a crabby. That was a crabby. Oh man, come on, bro. They all now, man. Y'all see how deep we fishing, man. They here. They here. It's that time. That was a crabby. I know for a fact. He, he, he came from the bottom and popped the card up. Damn. Missed it right out of his mouth. He had it, taking it off right there. I should just let him take it, man. We know now, man. We know now. If it happened again on this one right here, I'm gonna change it to the actual hook that I need to have it on, man. Because the other hook I got is kind of thicker than the other one, and that probably could be an issue. But y'all know how crappies work. You have that hook in their mouth, man. How they work. You have that hook in their mouth, and if you pull too hard or you get too excited. They mouth is real, real thin. It'll pop right out, man. That's exactly what just happened. That's how I know for a fact it was a, it was a crappie. Crappie's gonna come up, have the cart straight up, and when they come from the bottom, it lifts the cart up, it falls over, and then that means they got it in their mouth and they take off running, and it pulls the cart out there to the deeper end, and that's exactly what happened right there. That's exactly what happened. And we fumbled the play, y'all. We had our first one on, and it was a big, it felt heavy too, so it definitely was a big one. Oh, got him. Uh, let's go. Let's go. We taking them all, baby. We ain't tripping. Yee. Y'all see it. Be careful with this one, though, man. I done been popped by a couple of them. Little catfish, man. We out here. That's why I almost took my pole in the water. Let's go. Y'all see it. Y'all see the black dots on them? Black dots. A little catfish, man. Good eating right there, man. This ain't nothing like that store about. Ain't nothing like catfish fresh out the bayou, fresh out the lake. That's the best ones to have, man. He croaking. Gang, gang, gang. Watch out now, don't stab me. I'll tell y'all a story about dealing with a catfish one time. I was fishing with some crocs uh, probably about six years ago out down the way. And I, uh, I had a crocs and I decided I wanted to step on them, step on the catfish to try to get the hook out of his mouth. The catfish bowled up and the fin went right in my foot. In the fishing trip, right away. That sting and poison stuff or whatever that is that be on them, I can't deal with it. I pass on it. Get the hook out of his mouth. That's it right there, man. Back in the water, little fella go, man. Get another meal on there. I want y'all to get a good look at this. This is not a sponsored video. But if you ain't got one, man, y'all definitely need to check one. Check these out. Link will be in my uh, bio on where to buy them at. Uh, the link you can use or whatnot. Man, this 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 right here is probably one of the, my favorite fishing buckets, man. I just got it in. It was actually a few days late, so Amazon, man, I'm going to need y'all to uh, speed up the process. But uh, y'all need to check that, that brand out right there, man. Wasn't cheap, but if you like fishing, man, it comes with the air rate on the side of it. You can pull this little basket up. You see all the minnows in there, right? You pull it up, you don't really need a fishing net. This air rate already on the side, and it stay charged. They've been enough for about two days, still alive. And it's like, it's like a Yeti cooler. It lock on like that. Real small and compact. Hey, when I say they here, when I say they here, they here, man. When I say they here, hey. When I say they here, TK. When we say they here. Hold on. Make sure you get a good video on this one, baby. We gotta talk our shit when we got one of these in our hand. When I say they here, try to get the hook out so we don't kill them, man. When we say they here, man, they here. Let's get a good look at this real quick. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? When I say they here, them big motherfuckers here. That's how we like to have them right there, man. Perfect sizing. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? Let's get back in that water. They here, man. If it's one down there, 
If it's one down there, some more down there, for sure, for sure, man. How we looking? Looking good? If it's one down there, some more down there, man. Let's get back in there, man. Love to see it, man. You moved it. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Breaking them out of there, boys. Yes, sir. Breaking them out of there. I got to pull up. Look how I'm set up, man. I got pulled. We got three poles out. We getting bites on all of them, man. I'll put this one back down real quick for a minute. Let's bring this crap into the camera, man. Bring this crap into the camera. Let y'all get a look at it real quick. Y'all see it, man. Nice size crappie. Hey, like I said, man, you gotta be patient. You gotta be patient when it comes to these crappie. And I see what they what they gonna be sitting there right now, so we finna get back on this side real quick. You gotta be patient when it comes to these crappies, man. If you wanna catch them, man, you think they not oh, they not in there, you move a spot. We just had some people out here and they was fishing with us and they dipped out too quick, man. And I just being patient and stayed there. And now look at us, man. Like I said, they come on and then they turn off. You gotta be when you when you catch them, you gotta stay with it, man. That's what we're gonna do right here. We're gonna get this one out there. Hey man, end of day fishing, we fish a few hours, we caught a few, let a few back. Some were keeping, some wasn't. We caught a few catfish, caught striped bass, and a bunch of crappie. Today is come, fishing day has come to an end. It was definitely an amazing day like always, especially down here on the freshwater side. Um, we definitely gonna come out here tomorrow because I got a whole uh, cooler full of minnows, probably about 30 left. We don't want to waste those. We don't want to waste bait because it's hard to come by. Sometimes I get off work and the lady's not open. So I'm going to keep those on the air ready to make sure I have extra batteries so they can last until I get off work tomorrow. And we'll come out here and try again, man. So if you like the video, man, and y'all enjoyed it, we'll do a catch and cook here on the next video uh, once we catch some. And we'll, we'll go through that. But if y'all like the video, man, y'all like the content, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you watch this far. Uh, hit that like. Uh, also, I have the link. For the LFG merch, LFGfishing.com. Y'all wanna check that out, man. And uh, yeah, man, it was a great day. Thank you for watching. Peace out.